guys welcome back as usual good morning good afternoon good evening good night wherever you are whatever your time welcome back today i'm going to be making a christmas special and uh, that's um special it's called um apple cheddar bread for this recipe we're going to need a uh, two and a half cup flour three quarter cup sugar two teaspoon baking powder half teaspoon cinnamon half a teaspoon salt three quarter cup milk one quarter cup melted butter two eggs Two cups natural sharp cheddar cheese, one and a half cups apples, um, chopped apple, three quarter cup chopped nuts. I have here. Are you? I'm using walnuts, but you can use any nuts that you you would like to use. So um. I don't have quite three quarter cup walnuts, so I'm just gonna show you how I chop the nuts. Just chop like this with the, the knife. So this is about enough. This is about three quarter cup. Now I'm going to empty the rest of the nuts in this um, plastic dish or content. Let's put this aside. Which one and a half cup apples. I don't have quite one and a half, so I'm going to um a half of this Basically what we're going to do is uh, we're going to um, chop the, the apple as, as the way you chopped an, uh, an onion. So slice it down thin like this. Slice it down thin. And I'll chop it like an onion.
Okay, there you have it. So for my cheddar cheese, I had Swiss cheese. I didn't have the, the, uh, the cheddar cheese. So I have um, put color into it. I did have um, the color like cheddar cheese. I put some yellow um, food coloring with the little orange also mixed together. And here I have my um, cheddar cheese. So now we're gonna uh, mix all the dry ingredients together. Flour, sugar, baking powder, two teaspoons, cinnamon, salt. Nuts, start mixing them. The apples. And the shredded um, cheese. Melted butter, just scrape it out, scrape this down. Now we're going to add this to the dry ingredients and mix well. All the, you can see the pieces of apples, the nuts, and the cheese. You can see them. So now we're going to spoon this into a, a nine inch baking pan or loaf pan. But if you don't have a loaf pan, a baking pan is okay, nine inches. 
So we're now going to spoon this in. So but first you, you grease the, the pan well and, and flour. Grease, you put it in a nine greased and floured, nine inch greased and floured pan for baking loaf or loaf pan. So now I'm going to just put this spoon it. In the, uh, the oven in a preheat oven. I have the oven on already and you're gonna um, bake this at um, 180 Fahrenheit to 360 degrees for 60 to 70 minutes or until done. So I'm gonna place it in the oven now. And I'll be right back when it's finished or almost finished. The apple bread is, the cheddar apple bread is now finished so um, I'm going to let it cool for about 10 minutes and then we'll be back and I'll be back to check to take it out of the pan. The apple cheddar bread is now ready. It's um, cool now, it's still warm so now I'm going to just cut through it slowly. Wow, this is, this is how it looks inside. It's very nice, really beautiful. So I'm gonna have a taste of it. Well, I've baked it um, at Christmas time several times. So I know I know how it tastes, but I'm just gonna. Mm. It's really delicious. Mm. I like tasting everything in this: the apple, the nuts, the cheese. Mm. Everything is good. And the color is really beautiful as well. Mm. 
This is something you can really enjoy at Christmas with your family or at any other occasion. And please remember to um, subscribe. Please subscribe. You, know, you guys who haven't already subscribed, I would like you to subscribe and like and just leave a comment. Leave a comment and let me know how you like this apple cheddar bread. And share as well. And I wish you a Merry Christmas and a prosperous and Happy New Year. And God bless you. Until again, see you. Goodbye.